Hey friends, this is the Mrs. Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead, and it's Pantry Pool Meal tonight. Here's what we got. I uh, picked some beans today, so we're going to have some fresh green beans. I've got two partial bags of egg noodles, a jar of home canned ground beef, a can of mushroom soup, a can of sliced mushrooms, and the rest of the onion left over from last night's supper. Let's make dinner. Now, first things first. I'm going to, I've got some cold water here. I'm going to salt it. And I'm going to snap me some beans into this pot here. You know, I do a lot of canning of beans, but we work so hard to grow that garden, we should be able to eat some fresh every once in a while, right? My beans are actually slowing down. I got about uh, a dozen quarts. And I still have some from last year. And I'll probably get a couple more pickings of beans. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring these to a boil. And then I'll dump in the egg noodles and they should all cook about the same time. Love that snapping sound. I don't know why I bothered getting scissors out. They're fresh picked not two hours ago. Even my arthritic hands love snapping beans. It's funny, I can, that's a scarlet runner. I can tell you the difference in the beans. That's a scarlet runner. That's a Kentucky wonder. These are Polish pole beans. And these are Cherokee Trail of Tears. Isn't that wild? Beautiful. Those purple ones, once they uh, come up to boil, the purple ones will actually go green. It's they're perfect actually for if you if you need to blanch because they'll t when they turn green you know they've been blanched enough. I'm gonna put these on to boil and I'm gonna go out and pick a green pepper. Well, I went out into the garden. I found a few small peppers that had bug bites on them, so I figured we better use them. This is a hot pepper. I don't know how much I'm gonna use of it, and I decided to pull me a leek. From my leek beds. They're doing wonderful this year. So, I've washed it. Let me slice it into nice chunks. I love leeks. Let's get some of this green on. Oops, my little mat's sliding all over the place. Oh, yum. Put them in the bowl. And let's look at these peppers and see. Just cut that little bit off that had a bug bite. Look at a little, little snail in there. You see that? Little wee snail. You don't belong in there. Sorry. Your, your free ride is over. It's probably the bite. Kind of chunk them up a little bit. They're nice and crunchy. Right, my frying pan's hot. I'll be right back. 
See, the purple beans are now green. Perfect timing. Then go the noodles to cook with the beans. Which means we better smarten up with our chopping here. Let's get these going in, in the skillet there. Sorry, folks, I'm walking around with a tripod and filming with my phone. I good news is I have ordered a camera. But it may be a couple of weeks before it gets here. I'm not doing a lot of the, this pepper. Just a few little pieces. Give it some zing. There we go. We get our onion in there. Cut off the dead end, even if it was just in the fridge overnight. Onions are known to absorb, to uh, absorb stuff from the air. Especially sickness. Alrighty. There we are those tops. Let's get our ground beef in there. We wanted to put the raw vegetables in first because they need the most cooking. But we want the hamburger to be hot too, right? Now we're doing this over a medium high heat do our mushrooms and as soon as those veg uh, we can turn it up now to right in between medium and maximum and as soon as those veg start to cook we will add our mushroom soup I know there's people out there that said oh, you lost me as soon as you opened a can of mushroom soup well guess what Economy the way it is, this is, this is, if it continues, this is what Sunday dinners are going to look like. See? Now, you, these veggies are giving off some juice, so we're just going to use that juice to break down our good, thick mushroom soup concentrate here. Mm-hmm. Over green, fresh garden green. We got fresh garden leeks, fresh garden peppers, fresh garden beans. Let's add some of our noodle water. There we go. It's got the nutrients from the beans in it, don't it? I forgot how fast cast iron heats up and then holds its heat, even when you turn it down. Now look at that. Isn't that just scrum dilly -umptious? I wonder if I can fit this all into one pan. Oh, yeah. Just. Just. All right. When Howard gets home, we'll see if he likes it. I'm pretty sure the lack of zucchini is going to sell him on it. The noodles are a little al dente to soak up more of that sauce. Oh, yeah. All right, Papa is home. Do you want some Parmesan cheese on this, dear? Is that a trick question? Noodles and meat and mushrooms and chicken. No, it's ground it's beef. ground beef. Yeah, you can put a little cheese. On. How hungry are you? Parmesan, just a sprinkle for pizzazz, and of course, cracked black pepper. We'll see you at the couch. Okay, this is, it's a pantry pull meal. It's noodles and hamburger, leeks, onions, peppers from the garden, beans from the garden, and egg noodles, mushroom soup, and mushrooms. Seriously, Goo? Yeah, she wants her... She wants her bean. She doesn't... Oh, my gosh. Oh. Good. Yeah, I, I take it you're relieved there's no zucchini in it. Oh, yeah. Well, that'll be tomorrow night. 
Lucky me. Lucky you. This is the Mrs. Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead saying there's your pantry pull video of the week. Mwah! Take care. God bless. I love harvest season. Yeah.